<laughs> oh God! Oh, oh Jesus. God! We're going! Oh uh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> we're getting a ride in Nikki's truck. We're in the bed. <laughs> Y'all, it is September 21st Whoa. and we are about to hike a 14er. We're gonna hike Gray's and Tori's Peak and it is very cold right now. The water is frozen and my fingers are frozen, my toes are numb, but uh, we're doing it. This is our final ascent up to the summit. <laughs> How are we feeling? Tired. I'm so tired. <laughs> Where, <are you? laughs> Where am I? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, but where are we? <laughs> are we at Gray's? No. Oh, that's Gray's. God damn it. Summit! It's pretty okay up here, I guess. I mean, we just hiked up to Tori's Peak, and there was a cellist hiking up at the same time as us, and she is about to perform the jig from the first Bach cello suite, and this is gonna be fucking epic, and I'm really excited. Here we go. No, that's the wrong one. <laughs>
What's up, YouTube? So I just had my fourth weekend of the season. We're about to rig up for week five of work, and it was a pretty incredible weekend. First of all, last week at work, I didn't really vlog much, so I'm probably just gonna include a couple clips at the beginning of this video. It was week three of cutting tread for us at Maryland Creek. We're still working on building this new trail, and it was a pretty tiring, intense week. I feel like the repetitive work is really starting to get to me, and my back was aching, and I was starting to go a little bit crazy cutting tread but we still have two more weeks left of it so we'll see how that goes but anyway yeah this weekend was incredible I feel like as the season goes on it kind of intensifies that's how it was last year as well and I keep getting surprised by how the season keeps getting better and better we hiked Gray's and Tories peaks um, which are two 14ers meaning mountain peaks that go over 14,000 feet of elevation and it was just me and a couple of my friends that I've made um, from other crews and I forgot my boots at headquarters. Hello, sorry, my phone ran out of memory so that video cut off. But anyway, like I was saying, I forgot my boots at headquarters so I ended up doing the whole hike in my crappy Tevas, which probably wasn't the best idea for my feet but kind of made me feel like a badass so whatever. But it was just a really beautiful hike. We went this alternate route so we basically went up like the backside of the mountain and there was less of an established trail and and kind of felt more like we were just climbing the side of this huge mountain. The craziest part was that we were hiking right alongside this woman who was hiking with her cello on her back and right as we got to the second peak, um, Tori's Peak, she got up there and she performed two movements from a Bach cello suite and that just felt like one of those synchronicities in life. You know classical music has always played such a big part in my life and then to just get to see a performance like that on such a beautiful summit in the Rock Mountains. It really felt like a gift from the universe. We got dinner in Breck that night. It was really fun. And then the next day I kind of just chilled in the steamboat like I usually do and hung out with my friend Romeo. And we went searching for this sulfur cave that apparently exists somewhere in Steamboat. Uh, we didn't really find the cave though. And yeah, I feel like there were just so many little moments from this weekend that felt pretty magical. It's crazy to me that now there are only three weeks left of the season. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this episode of Trail Crew. Um, if you'd like to support me, the best way to do that would be to subscribe. And maybe you can leave this video a like and a comment down below. And I will see you in the next one.